In this video, we will learn about TCP view, which is a window program that will show you detailed listing of all incoming and outgoing connection of TCP and UDB protocols, including the local and remote addresses and state of TCP connections. It is very easy to use and you don't need to install anything to make TCP view work. It is a standalone executable, making it extremely easy to use. So we can search on Google for this. I will type TCP view. And from Microsoft side, we can go to this link. And you can download from here download TCP view and we can go to the download folder and you can extract this one because it's a zip file you need to extract you can just right click on it and click on extract all and you can select the folder where you want to extract to i'm just gonna go with this one and click on extract and now we are inside the extracted folder and you can see the tcp view and you need to click on TCP view, TCP view which is an application and you need to click yes it is asking permission to run this program and you need to agree and this TCP view is started. Now it will enumerate all active TCP and UDB endpoints. You can see the local hosts and the remote addresses and their state, listening, established, and so on. And you can also see the remote port and connection to the remote port or the local port sometimes it happens that you are running one service and it is using some port and you want to install or start another service which may conflict with the already open port so you can also check which ports are open on your local machine so this is very useful and helpful software and you can also check which uh, in coming connections are and outgoing connections are and it also help you identify unexpected tcp communications such as those on a system infected with a malware or trojan virus you can see if they are making outgoing connection to some uh, website or some other ip address Each endpoint is listed with the owning process. On the left side, you can see the process name, the protocol and the local and remote address, and the endpoint state. Changing between refresh periods are highlighted in green, yellow, or red. New endpoints are shown in green, Endpoints that have changed states are in yellow and close endpoints are in red. Local address column shows which port process have open on the local system, local address. And the remote address column gives you details on the connections destination. These are remote address column. 
we can also right click on endpoint context menu to perform a who is lookup on the remote address for example i will go over here and just right click on it and click on who is And you can see over here, this is the who is information on the remote address. So this is very useful program for your network connections on your system. And also if you want to look up ports that are being used on your system. So, and the process which are running and listening to connections incoming and also opening connection to remote servers or machines. You can also close these connections by right clicking on it and just click on end process. The process will end. And you have more option over here up you can explore those too to keep on learning please subscribe to my youtube channel a same code keep supporting me and thank you for watching